Hello, welcome to another quick can diagnostic episode. Today's riveting video, it's a two minute short. Um, I've come out to an Isuzu N75 and N series, um, so the cab changed on it and it doesn't start. Um, so I'm back probed into the ECU and that is the can line. They were currently sitting at about 12 volts on can, both cans. Um, they look shorted together to me. Um, but it's just a quick show of how unplugging things can give you pretty much instant information. So I'm going to disconnect the cab, or the, the CAN bus from the cab to the actual chassis, the lorry. Okay, so look at how khaki that is. What I'm going to do. Unplug the CAN. So now the CAN bus from the, from the actual, the chassis, the engine, is disconnected from the cab. Go back round. Normal service resumed. Okay, so it's just a quick test. I'm <clears throat> thinking why, what's going on in the cab, because there's been a fair few parts changed on this. Body computer immobiliser. Um, however, the actual wiring loom is different in this cab to the old one, so we're gonna have to swap the um, the whole dashboard out. You can see here this pin. If you look on this on the connector, that pin's not there. In fact, there's quite a lot of pins that are missing, or extra pins that are here that we don't have here. So it needs it all. It needs all the. Uh, it needs all the dashboard swapping for the one, the original one. So it's only a quick video just to show the importance of the unplug it test. It's taken me maybe less than 10 minutes of being here to know what to know which direction we have to go in and this company's been doing this for about three weeks so till next time tada